hey guys what's going on and welcome or welcome back to my channel so for today's video i am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the swiss beauty non-transfer cat lip crayons now they have come out with 26 shades and i have picked out 13 of them so as always you can check the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference i'm nc40 in mac and in maybelline i'm 310 sun beige now if you have not already then do not forget the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to the notified whenever i upload and now let's jump right into the video So first, let's quickly go over with the benefits of these lip crayons. Now, it says that it is a non-transfer and water-resistant formula, ensures that the color stays put all day long. Infused with nourishing jojoba oil and vitamin E for healthy, nourished lips. The lip crayon has a retractable design, eliminates the need for sharpening, making it easy to use and mess-free. The lightweight formula of our matte lip crayon lasts up to 8 hours and is comfortable on the lips. Now, like I mentioned before, they do offer a total of 26 shades and they are priced at 299 rupees each for 1.5 grams of product and I picked mine off of Nykaa. So this is how the lip crayon looks like. So the base and the cap is color coordinated and these are retractable. And now let's finally move on to the lip swatches.
right so let's quickly go over with the formula the pros and the cons now firstly these are very pigmented so just one swipe you will get the full opacity and when you apply them it glides on very smooth and soft which is a great thing now these are quite comfortable on the lips it does not feel like you're wearing anything on your lips at all and initially when you apply them it does go on a pretty creamy and then it dries down to a matte finish now these do settle into a matte finish quite quickly however it takes about three to five minutes for it to completely dry down so that it can become a transfer proof like for example it is completely transfer proof right now now these lasted on me for like a good six to seven hours and then i had to eat and once i had a heavy meal this is how it looked like and as you guys can see the outer line is left over and once you do press your lips together it will give you like a sheer coverage of the original color but then there is one point where I will discuss about it later. So put a pin on it. I will get back to it in some time. And lastly, for the removal of these lip crayons, I will highly recommend using an oil based product. I just use like the oil infused micellar water and that worked like a charm. And now for the FII, there are two points. The first point is that there is no smell on these lip crayons, which is great. And the second point is that you will have to make sure that your lips are well prepped and moisturized beforehand, because if your lips are chapped, it will emphasize it. So yeah. And now for the cons, there is just one point that these lip crayons, once they set completely and if you do press your lips together, it will become grainy and powdery and the color sort of comes off in a kind of a patchy manner. So yeah, personally for me, this is a con because I subconsciously kind of press my lips together when I'm working or if I'm concentrating on something. I just do that and I do not like my lipstick or my lip crayons to be grainy. I have mentioned about this before. So yeah, for me, this is a con. So yeah, guys, these were my thoughts on the Swiss Beauty's non-transfer cat lip crayons. And this finally wraps today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, then do not forget to subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I upload as well as like the video and comment down below. If you have any questions or requests, I will try and best it for you as well as follow me on my socials with Shania on Instagram and Shania on Twitter as well. So until the next time, take care. Bye.